Hello and welcome to Tuesday's Daily Financial Digest. The dollar-yen pair has gained 0.5% in the last session. The highs lows indicator has transitioned into the neutral zone. The price of gold has added 1.9% in the last two sessions. The stochastic RSI has skyrocketed into positive territory. Bitcoin has added 3.6% in the last two sessions. The ADX has lost steam and is now giving a neutral signal. The Aussie dollar pair has gained 0.6% in the last three sessions. Stochastic is receding into the positive area. And now let's hear what our chief analyst picked up for us today. Amazon relies on extensive worker surveillance to boost employee output and potentially limit unionization efforts around the U.S., according to a research paper issued by the Open Markets Institute. The vast majority of Japanese crypto traders may be investing solely in Bitcoin. According to recent data, Bitcoin's dominance relative to altcoins in the Japanese market reached more than 87% in April. While the S&P boasted its steepest August percentage gain in more than three decades, and the Nasdaq rallied thanks to high-flying stocks, including Apple. Those were today's major economic events, and now moving on to world financial headlines. The German retail sales will be released at 400 GMT, the German manufacturing PMI at 555 GMT, the German unemployment rate at 555 GMT, the Eurozone's unemployment rate at 700 GMT, the U.S. Red Book at 1055 GMT, and the U.S. Manufacturing PMI at 1145 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Tuesday's financial report. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join us tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.